Number one is Passum Sam with the T-Bar Stables Incorporated of Chillicothe, Ohio, trained by Bill Taylor with Jeff Ace Nysunger. Number two is Oz Shade, owned by Brighton Ball and Diamond Chimp Stable and Scott Mogan. They're all the Buckeye State, trained by Scott Mogan with the hitman, Brett Miller. Number three is Stinky Flynn, owned by James Cargo of Moore, Ohio, trained by Jack Daly. Jeff Daly is up. The four is Albion What Punchwall, owned by Jay Sears at Deerfield Beach, Florida, and George Brody of Hudson, Florida, trained and driven by Jay Sears. Number five is Western Intent by the National Trail Investment Company and Corporation of uh, Bean Station, Tennessee, trained by Dan Ader, Kyle Ader at the lines. The six is Town Bullet. Scott Piney's Budweiser Best Better Than Night is owned by Redmond of Mount Gilead, Ohio, and Mullinex of Wassian, Ohio, trained by Jim Mullinex. Jim Daly is up. And for the outside of the seven is Call Me Jate by the Oldfield Farm Incorporated of Sand Creek, Michigan, trained by Richard Oldfield, Bob Harper, in the sulky old in motion. They're all fan pacing and firing away. Middle of the track, there goes the three. Stinky Flynn from the inside. There is Passum Sam. Driving up from the outside, there is Comey Jate. They're three deep into the first turn. Coming away in fourth is Oz Shade. Fifth, there is Albion Watt Punchwell. Dropping in in sixth is Town Bullet. And seventh, and trying the field. That is Western in ten. They're still stacked up three deep. Going to the opening quarter and from the inside. With the lead here, that is Passum Sam. Opening panel in 20. Six and three fives as they pass the stand for the first time and head on down to the half and call me Jate and Bob Harper finally clears to the front end here, leading it by a length and a half. Rolling out of the wire with five eighths of a mile remaining. Pass some Sam is racing in second. Stinky Flynn dropped in third. First to flush coming with a rush on the outside in fourth. Here comes Aw Shade. The inside five is Albion. What punch will on to the cover flow. Second up on the outside in sixth is Town Bullet and seventh and trailing the field, but a tip to the outside, Western in ten. They're off the half in 56 seconds flat. Off the turn and driving down the backside. Heads are pointed towards three quarters and on top. Call me Jate leads it here by length. Grinding it out first over the outside. Racing in two. That is Oz Shade. On the inside. Pass him. Sam is racing in third. And ready to swing up three wide of the outside and does so now. Here comes Town Bullet. And Town Bullet is circling up three wide of the outside. By three quarters and one. 24 and three fives. They'll pace the final turn and head for home and call me Jate has won a huge mile here and is opening up by two Town Bullet is trying to come to him in second Western Intent off the turn to the top of Heartbreak Lane less than an eighth of a mile to go and down the stretch they come and call me Jate is rocking away here call me Jate Albion what punch was pacing on late but it's call me Jate wrapped up here finishing second Albion what punch will third was the six Town Bullet the time of the mile 150 Three, three thefts. Call me Jate. A three old brown outing by Jate Lobel out of a Weeby Fast Mare. She by Bruce Gimble. By the Oldfield Farm Incorporated of Sand Creek, Michigan. Trained by Richard Oldfield. Nicely handled here this evening by catch driver Bob Harper. Time of the mile, 1.53, three thefts. Again, a new lifetime mark. Third win in 2003, the seven. Call me Jate and Bob Harper. Early double, 8-7, 149.80, 4 exact and 96.40, 7-4-6 try. Returned $192.20. Now, Mr. Harper, don't get too far away. 